Hi, I just got to the foundry and uh, they're finishing up uh, a bronze that's going overseas. And uh, looks great. All right, uh, we're going to be getting started on uh, Island Song pretty quick here, so I'm going to let uh, Isaac finish that up and uh, I'm going to get my camera set. Plants uh, correcting a little tiny little blemishes that were on the piece. Uh, this is uh, what raw bronze looks like. It's uh, white metal. If you buff it up, it'll look like brass because of the uh, brass that's, or the copper that's in it and the tin, which by the way, once I pay for the bronze, I got to pay the uh, cost of the uh, bronze, uh, copper that's in the bronze. And you can see here where he buffed it up a little bit, how it's shiny it gets. One for overseas and one for here in the United States, but anyway, just wanted to show you what they look like in wax. They haven't put the sprues or the pore spouts on them yet, so that's uh, still to be done. Kind of cool to see them this way. Alright, what Isaac is doing is putting potash. It's a cold acid that he puts on to the bronze. It reacts to the uh, copper in the bronze and uh, turns it completely black. It's, it's the smelly stuff that you put on a copper plate and in art class when you're doing a, a rubbing or whatever you call those things that I used to do back in school. I don't know if they still do that or not. But anyway, this just turns it all black. It gives it the base coat and then he rubs back in those areas that uh, will be lighter and, uh, and, and doesn't rub back in those areas that won't be lighter. Just 
Now you use just regular Johnson's face wax. Yep. And because the bronze is hot, it will just melt and flow. Now is when the color will settle into what it's going to look like when it's finished. Kind of avoiding all the uh, clean in the grass. You just hit the highlights with this flag. Yeah. You're going to leave the green pretty much without any kind of a uh, wax I'm on gonna, it. Or just hit the edges see of it. See, I'm waxing the highlights. I got you. So it'll be a lot more subtle green where it'll be there, but. You've got a lot of strong bronze highlights that ties yeah. everything together. Yeah. I think it's going to work really nice. And all these greens are going to have just enough shiny highlight, you know? Exactly. Make everything work. See, what he's doing is he's not digging the wax back into the recesses of the leaves. He's leaving those untouched by the wax, so they're dull a dull green, but he's hitting the very tips that have been hit with a buffer and that brings out the shininess just a little bit on the ends of them, which is fine. Alright, it's uh, cooled off quite a bit. It's dulled down a lot. If you remember, it was really shiny before. Everything's uh, the wax is is setting setting up on the bronze now and pretty soon we'll be able to mount it on its base because uh, can't do that while it's really hot. Alright guys, that's it.